What's up, my Saggies? Welcome back. Welcome to your Daily Juice for June the 19th, 2023. It's Monday. What's up, guys? What's up? What's up? Um, if you're new, go ahead and subscribe to the channel, guys. All right, welcome and welcome back to my Saggies. Let's get to it. So, Sagittarius, in your Daily Juice, you are reaching your final destination, okay? Um, it says, don't stop now. Keep pushing. You're closer than you think. There's an ultimate aim you're out on. There's an outcome. You're almost there at your final destination here, okay? Um, we have angelic help that's coming in for you, Sagittarius. Your angels are helping you in, a pow in powerful ways. Look for signs and messages as they come to you. There's miracles, okay? There's synchronicities. There's support here with your angels, all right? We have subtle energy here. Don't under underestimate your power. Subtle energy travels faster than you know. You know, um, maybe people are underestimate you at this time, Sagittarius. Don't underestimate yourself. Okay. At the bottom of the deck of the tarot, we have the lovers' energy, Gemini energy. It says, embrace the true love and deep, intuitive relation friendships. Make choices from the heart, vibrant health, or recovery from an illness. So you guys may be recovering from a short illness here, Sagittarius. So definitely making choices in life of who you need to give your time and energy to. Okay, this could be your relationships here as, as far as like um, love relationships, Sagittarius, or people that you deal with in your normally daily life, okay? Um, right here, this could be, this is, uh, could be in the past that's happened or right now we have the three of pentacles here. It says, do what you love. All right. And then what's clarifying this is the 10 of wands. Something that has came a big burden to you, Sagittarius. Okay. Something has, is a big burden here, Sagittarius, and you're giving up on something. You, you're starting new and fresh at this time. You, maybe you work too hard for many hours here. Um, this need for a balance in your life. Let others help you if you need help. Um, health problems due to stress here you know stress can really 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 affect you Sagittarius so make sure you're not stressed out but with this clarifying it I see that you are starting to do things that you love Sagittarius and leaving some burdens in the past okay some of you guys may be leaving a job here that's stressful here that's, you're not getting what you want you're not getting the recognition that you need and you're leaving this job here but it says do what you love here with the three of pentacles recognition for the highest quality of work especially creative endeavors being paid well for your craft working with well with others um, so yeah, maybe you, um, in a group setting Sagittarius, you are working so hard, other, uh, working harder than other folks that's on the team with you. Okay. And I see that you're leaving this alone. All right. You're like, you know what? I'm focused on my, what I need to do because y'all are not doing your job. All right. Or maybe this has happened in the, in the past Sagittarius in a, in a love relationship where you had to leave somebody out because you were doing all the work. Okay. Um, also, in the present moment, in your energy, you have the Ten of Cups, Sagittarius, and that is so beautiful. This is a beautiful energy here, and I, I'm, I'm loving it, okay? And your energy is the Ten of Cups today, okay? It says a happy marriage, happily ever after, emotional contentment here, a love and relationship with your children, raising children, and successfully, um, people you can trust here. This is your family. This is your friends here. This is your rainbow, Sagittarius. Your rainbow is here in your energy today. What's going on with you with the Ten of Cups? I love this energy, Sagittarius. And I clarified. I said, you know... What is this energy spirit, guys, for Sagittarius with the Ten of Cups? They said the Two of Wands. So some of you guys may be coming to partnership with someone. So this person may live a little bit at distance. They may live across the world in another state, another city, another country here. But you are taking the next steps to be with somebody here. You're bold. You're ambitious and making choices here. You're coming together with somebody at this time. Um, and whoever you're coming together with, you share the same dreams. Okay, you're, exp you're expanding all your plans, Sagittarius. Continue to move forward with the two of wands. So I see two people coming together in a relationship atmosphere, okay, with your family. And then I clarified again. I said, what's the Ten of Cups? The Ten of Pentacles. Your money, stability, family wealth, your fi financial security for yourself and your family, Sagittarius. Inheritance, retirement, peace and contentment in life, okay. Um... Your money looks good. We got a Ten of Cups and a Ten of Pentacles in your energy. That's awesome, Sagittarius. Like, things are definitely coming together for you, okay? They are coming together for you here. And I also see some of you guys are moving into a relationship. Somebody's getting married here. Somebody's moving into a higher level commitment that's coming in for you, okay? Or you're definitely dealing with somebody that you're falling in love with, Sagittarius, all right? Okay, here we have the people that you could be dealing with or somebody that's very significant in your life. We have the Ten of Swords. Somebody that's walking out of your life or definitely you kicking somebody out, okay? Or you walking away from someone. Ten of Swords energy here. Somebody's leaving, okay? The end of a situation that belongs to... Let me see. 
the end of a situation that brings relief, sadness, or both, okay? Whoever's leaving, okay, is going to bring you some type of relief, okay? Um, or sadness here. The opportunity for new happiness is coming in because this Ten of Swords is leaving. A weight off your shoulders, the end of addiction, okay? So, so whoever this is leaving, Sagittarius, is giving you a relief off your shoulders, all right? And the world energy here, it says a brilliant success, a time of joyful accomplishment, a spiritual alignment here. Um, be proud of yourself. So there is the ending of a situation, but the thing is, it's going to be successful. Okay. Um, maybe this person walking out of your life, Sagittarius hurts you to the core, but the thing is it needs, it needs to end because something wasn't right with the Ten of Swords, the betrayal, um, lies here. You know, somebody was being stabbed in the back. You kept did this to this person and vice versa, but this person is walking out of this door. Okay. There's an ending here. Um, and the outcome, Sagittarius, we have the Three of Swords, okay? And it says, great sadness. Um, don't like the energy, but we're going to talk about it. Great sadness that will heal with time. Let go of the past personal growth that comes with from challenges, healing, misunderstandings, being there for, for the, those in need. So Three of Swords energy and the challenge um, and the outcome, Sagittarius, this is something here where, you know, it's, it's, it's hard for you to get over. Okay, you've been hurt. Um, you've been betrayed here. Three of Swords energy. And kind of hard for you to trust too. But I see that with the Leo energy here, you're gaining your strength. Okay. Um, personal power and assertive, um, assertive portrayed with kindness, compassion that brings about forgiveness. Realizing that you are stronger than you knew. And I feel like Sagittarius, through it all here, even though that things have definitely hurt you, Sagittarius, you realize that you're stronger than you figure out to be. Okay. I clarified. I was like, you know, why is this Three of Swords here? What's the... Um, the best, uh, what was it? Oh my goodness. Uh, the best scenario here from the three of swords is the page of wands. And guess what the page of wands is? It's fire energy. So with this ending, with a betrayal, with something ending here, with somebody walking out of your life, Sagittarius, it's only good because there's a new start for you. Okay. Um, news of exciting opportunities here, allowing your creativity to soar, do things that fuel your passion. Finish what you start. So there's a new, um, new, embracing the new here with the Page of Wands. There's something new here. There's a messenger here. There's good news that's coming in for you. All right. Um, even though that somebody's walking out of your life, if somebody's walking away, something's ending with someone, there's happiness here. Because I feel like you definitely have two energy Sagittarius here where you're dealing with somebody that's walking out and you're dealing with somebody that you're coming together with. Okay. This could be a same sex relationship also. All right. Um, let's look at. Get a little bit deeper and see what Holy Spirit Spirit guys have to say about love here, okay? All right. <clears throat> what is the message for Sagittarius? We got three of Pentacles here. Let's clarify these energies. Three of Pentacles here. Three of Leaf. What is this? We have what is this? Getting to know each other and finances and career. Maybe you're dating somebody that's on your job, Sagittarius. You're getting to know somebody while you're releasing somebody else here. Um, financial issues um, is affecting your love life. Maybe you were burdened down by somebody. Financial issues, Sagittarius. Um, they didn't have what they needed, so they, they burdened you down. Okay. What is this ten of, ten of water, ten of cups, and Sagittarius energy today? <clears throat> Excuse me. Ten of cups here. What's the Ten of Cups here in Sagittarius Energy today? We got trust and playfulness. Oh, so I definitely feel like you're meeting someone. It says playfulness here to recapture, recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit to and fun to shine. And then we have this trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith, okay? Whatever it is with this Ten of Cups with your family here is, is, is calling you to trust and have faith in the situation. All right. If you're going into a commitment, maybe you're afraid, Sagittarius, like somebody's going into a wedding, somebody's getting married, somebody's going into a commitment. What's the Ten of, ten of Pentacles here for Sagittarius, Holy Spirit? It's the ten of Pentacles here, Spirit, guys. Give your relationship a chance and worth waiting for. So somebody feels like you... Um, they want you to give the relationship a chance and they, they feel like they're worth waiting for or vice versa. <clears throat> Excuse me, Sagittarius. But um, yeah, like somebody that you're with feel like they're worth waiting for or you feel like somebody's worth waiting for here, Sagittarius. Take it how it resonates, okay? But it is definitely safe for you to love here. Let's see about this Ten of Swords, this person walking out. Tell me about this Ten of Swords, this person walking out, Holy Spirit. This Ten of Swords here. 
attraction. So there, there was a good, a, a strong attraction between you and this person. Okay. Um, why is the Ten of Swords here? In this person's energy. You may have children with this person. This person that um, act like a child, or they're very controlling. Okay. They're very, very controlling. Somebody didn't let the, this, the situation unfold naturally. Okay. Somebody has some healing to do themselves. We had a three of swords in outcome. What's the three of swords in outcome? Three of swords, three of air. Healing family issues. Your love life is benefits as you forgive your parents or forgive this person <coughs> who has definitely hurt you, Sagittarius. Yeah, I see that you're pulling back your healing here. Um, but you're starting a new beginning with yourself here and you're calling in your soulmate, which I feel like the ten of, ten of cups here, you're calling in your soulmate. <clears throat> Give me this page of wands. Energy. Excuse me, Sagittarius. Page of wands. This new energy here, page of wands here for Sagittarius, page of fire. Release your ex, okay? There's something new here for you. You need to release your ex here, okay? And whoever this new person is, you need to express your love because you deserve love. Okay, Sagittarius? All right, let's read your guidance here. No more complaining. Complaints are affirmations of victimhood, which is never spiritually. Take back your God-given power by affirming that you have an abundance of choices and freedom with your increased confidence and assertiveness assertiveness watch these positive affirmations blossom into reality speak it out loud Sagittarius stay positive when you speak those positive affirmations Sagittarius I guarantee you this is what you'll get back because I'm experiencing it myself okay Sagittarius successful findings your idea is divinely guided and supported by the same infinite wisdom of God that gave you the idea. Do not allow money concerns to prevent you from turning it into reality. Crowdfunding, partnerships, and other investments are available to help you. There's an idea that you have in your mind, Sagittarius. Some of you guys definitely want to be entrepreneurs. You want, you want it, you taste it, you feel it, you see it, but you like it. You feel like it's so far away to do it, but you can't do it, Sagittarius. Write down your plan. Step one, what do you need to do? Step two, um, if you have... The, you don't have the financial finances to do it, Sagittarius. Um, you know, Spirit Guys are saying Sagittarius is here for you. Just go for it, okay? Um, apply for a business license. Get your EIN number, Sagittarius. Um, if you guys need a little bit more information on how to get your business started, I can, you know, give you a little bit of information of what I know. Inbox me if you're interested, okay? Um, last one here. We're going to ask a question and get an answer for you. We have fairy blessings. Expect something wonderful to be orchestrated by the divine intervention. Reward, gift, help. There's some joyful, uh, joyful occasion, something happening good today for you. Come back, Sagittarius, later on today, okay, and let me know what it, what this blessing is, what this gift is, what this fairy blessing is, okay? Um, yeah. Ask a question, get an answer. What's the best and highest answer for Sagittarius today, Holy Spirit? Ask a question, get an answer. They're telling me to do three questions. So I'm going to ask three questions, okay? Three questions for you. We'll do this three times. So, all right. First answer for Sagittarius. As I shuffle the deck, focus on your question, Sagittarius. Holy Spirit, Holy Angel, Spirit, guys, what's the best and highest answers for Sagittarius today? And three of their questions. We'll do three of their questions. We'll do three of their questions. Three of their questions for Sagittarius. <laughs> okay. All right, first question, Sagittarius. Think about your first question. What's the first question for Sagittarius? What's the best and highest answer for Sagittarius? What's the best and highest answer for Sagittarius in their first question? Okay. Yes, results will be slowly and steady. That's a definite yes, okay? Let's do your second question. What's the best and highest answer for the second question for Sagittarius? What's your second question, Sagittarius? Holy Spirit, what's the best answer for Sagittarius second question. What's the second answer for Sagittarius? Here we oh, that was too many. And you know what they oh my god, wait a minute. They all saying no, but I'm not gonna <laughs> we're gonna do that. What's the best and highest answer for Sagittarius in their second question? What's the best and highest answer for Sagittarius in their second question, Holy Spirit? Okay, what we got? Yes, dealing with the past will help you bring it to fruition. Okay, that's a definite yes. Last and third answer, Sagittarius. What's the best and highest answer for Sagittarius? This third answer. What's the best and highest answer for Sagittarius? Last answer to their question. 
What's the best? Here we go, Sagittarius. What's the answer to Sagittarius' question? Here we go, Saggy. What's the answer to their question, Holy Spirit? Yes, it's happening faster than you think. Be willing to take risk to get ahead. Sagittarius, you got three yeses. You got three yeses, okay? Remember, think positive because guess what? Look at this. Bad intentions will manifest bad situations. Don't think negative. Think positive. Speak your positive affirmations every day, three times a day, Sagittarius. Your fairy blessings are coming. Um, you got powerful things that's happening in your life right now, Saggy. Okay? Like, share, subscribe, guys. It's free. I love you. Comment below. Excuse me. Comment below. Talk to you later, guys. Bye.